America has experienced a lot of shortages during this pandemic, from PPE supplies to toilet paper to dumbbells. I know, dumbbells, right? With gyms being closed, sales went through the roof until they sold out. Now, the supply chain to restock, well, guess what? Backlog, too, and the inventory is still catching up. Our next guest says, no dumbbells, no problem. Joining us via Zoom is Dr. Jedediah Ballard. He's a former U.S. Army Ranger and 2016 men's ultimate health guy, and he's going to try to make me look bad. <laughs> What's up, man? Hey, how you doing, Dr. Ian? Good to see you, man. So you have three exercises we can do right at home with a body weight and a backpack, right? Correct, yeah, and standard burpee is great because it's almost a total body weight. You're gonna hit your push muscles really well, get that booty, get your legs, get your core somewhat, and it's a great cardiovascular move. So I'll just take you through the normal one first, then we'll mix it up a little bit. Okay. Coming back, you're just gonna drop down into a push-up position. You can either do the push-up or not, depending on your level, and then pop back up, do the jump again. Real time. I like that. And, you know, everybody has a little bit of a love-hate with these exercises, but they are very effective, very efficient. The next one is one of my favorites, by the way. I love this. I mean, it gives you such a workout. The mountain climber. Yeah, and you can work the mountain climber into a burpee if you really want to work on uh, <laughs> making up for all that quarantine snacking, which we've all been <laughs> doing, too. So coming back, just like our regular burpee, what we're going to do is we're going to drop down the push-up position, but then we're going to do the mountain climber. One, two, three, four. Come up in a jumping jack, real time. Just like that. <laughs> and you can tell one rep I'm breathing just a little bit. It'll gas you pretty quick. It's a great total body workout. I told you, it's a great workout. And Jedediah, I tell people, listen, if you can't get on the ground, it's too much movement, you can actually go against the wall and do a modified burpee. I mean, there are other things you can do to modify it. Fully agree. You just got to work with whatever level you're at, stay consistent, make little improvements, and you'll get better. And lastly, you say, another one of my favorites, the row, the old-fashioned row. Yeah, and the only thing the burpee's not hitting are your pull muscles, your bicep and your back here. So a couple ways you can make up for that. One is any sort of chin-up. So tree branch, door frame, door frame chin-up bars. But you're going to have to use your whole body weight, which means it's pretty advanced. What most people are going to want to do is grab something like a backpack full of books. And you just come back, keep your back real flat. Kind of stick your butt out, back flat, and you just squeeze your shoulder blades together. That's one. Squeeze together. That's two. Squeeze together. Just like that. That's going to hit your biceps and your back really well. If you get stronger, put in another book. Uh, kid also works. Use a little holder strap. It's great, um, great way to get total body when you mix that in with a burpee. Hey, Dr. Ballard, who says that you still can't work out at home even though you don't have equipment or don't have gyms, right? It's all about being creative. <laughs> And just people who want excuses, <laughs> you can get it done. All Thanks right, a lot, yeah. Dr. Ian. I appreciate you.